We're taking routine dung samples from a batch of lambs to identify if they need a dose. Taking a dung sample, faecal egg sampling of, of lambs. Um, ideally, we do this indoors. Um, in particular, if we're, if we're doing a drench test, you'll be bringing in a bunch of lambs uh, into a clean concrete pen. But it's also possible, or you're, it's also um, feasible, to take dung samples out in the field, particularly if we're taking routine dung samples from a batch of lambs to identify if they need a dose. So ideally what we should be doing is coming into a field of lambs where the lambs are settled and lying down as you can see some of the lambs here in the background. What we do is we shoot them up, um, push them into a corner in the field and hold them there for five minutes or so and the lambs will start defecating and particularly if a lot of them have been lying down they'll defecate when they get up. Now that we've had the lambs here for, for five to ten minutes there'll be lots of fresh um, fecal deposits around that particular area where we held them and then you come along just basically touch the fecal deposit to make sure it's warm it's a fresh deposit then we get our pot we want about 10 samples 10 fresh samples roughly around the same amount from each sample so we use the little spoon that's provided on the pot to take roughly around the same amount of feces from each deposit into into the pot okay and when we have it all inside there then try and uh, firm it down close the pot keep it airtight keep it out of out of sunlight away from heat so don't leave it in the jeep um, you know and get it to the, 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 the lab as soon as possible so ideally post it on a, a Monday or a Tuesday so that it gets gets to the lab it's not sitting in a post office over the weekend and they basically will have a look at the sample and and give us a result in terms of an egg count which will inform our decision as to whether the lambs need a dose for worms or not.